<laughs> hey guys, it's Sai. Welcome to the Quill. <laughs> there are so many cool cars here, so much good food here, and so many famous people here. <laughs> so let's go have a good time at the Quail today. <laughs> So we got our medallion and a little booklet, which the most important thing in the booklet is all the places there's food, guys. They have the most amazing food here. All right, we're going to go run to Lamborghini because they're going to be unveiling the SVJ very, very soon. Everybody's grabbing champagne right as you walk in, but I want to have my hands free to film the SVJ unveiling for you guys. I don't know if you guys saw last night, they showed the SVJ 63, but right now they're actually going to be showing the SVJ. Not the 63, but I think it's going to be the green one. Not really sure, but <laughs> we'll go see. Lamborghini is over there. In the beginning of the SVJ reveal, is of course, right. I got the Strad Man first and access. center. We got 25 minutes. So we're gonna stand right here also, so we get a good view yep. also. Bugatti Automobiles, Mr. Stefan Winkelmann. <laughs> bonjour, bonjour, mesdames, messieurs, et bienvenue chez Bugatti. Ladies, our Vice President for R&D, and Achim Anscheid, who is our Director of Design. Gentlemen, the Bugatti Digo. <laughs> The Bugatti Vivo. This is the world premiere. It's very exciting also for me, I can tell. And I will talk a bit about the design, the design with the performance. And uh, then I will want to wrap it up. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, I found Shmi at the Quill. We're literally playing car vlogger spotting too. Okay. <laughs> well, it was inevitable I would be in front of the Devo. I Not know. that we can see it Did right now. I, I saw the cover coming back, but now it's been completely oh spotted. <laughs> yeah, no chance. Oh, really great seeing you here. Likewise, nice to meet you. It's a beautiful day. Lots of nice cars around. Yeah. Food stop number one. <laughs> I think they have about like six or six or seven different cuisines you can try here. This is the Japanese one we just walked into. Ooh. Looks pretty good. Don't forget, the most important part is eating all the food here. <laughs> all of it. So this is Italian. I guess it's sponsored by Pirelli. <laughs> Looks, I think it's pizza. 
Guys, food stop number like four. We found Chinese food. <laughs> Behind me, guys, is the Hennessy Venom F5. I've actually never seen this car before, so I decided to throw it in my vlog because it looks really cool. And that's the engine. It's a 7.6 liter twin turbo V8. Cool. Are you a vlogger? Yeah. <laughs> All right, it. sorry. Well, this is the Venom F5. Uh, this is the second generation of our hyper car that we built. The first being the Venom GT. Um, so this car has a 7.6 liter V8 twin turbo engine. Uh, it's gonna make north of 1,600 horsepower. So. Wow, 1,600? Yeah. So. Body fast, right? Yeah. Yeah. So Faster. our goal is to uh, go 300 miles an hour. So I think we'll be able to do that with our 1,600 horsepower vehicle. Uh, it weighs around 2,800 pounds. So I think the only question is the road. But besides that, we're we think we're gonna do 300 miles an hour. Wow, that's amazing. Guess who I found, guys? This is jo Josh Altman. He's in Million Dollar Listing. You guys might recognize him from there, but he's also an amazing realtor in LA. Also really into cars, which is why yes. we're here today yes. in Monterey at the Delay. That's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. You, have a, you have a roll, right? I do. I got a roll. What else do you have? I got a Karma. Okay. I got a 73 Ferrari Pino. Wow. I got a Range Rover and a couple other things. Wow. But, <laughs> but I like awesome. cars. I like them. You've seen a lot of them on the show. You've seen the Bravo, Million Dollar Listing, Josh Allman. I'm out. I got to go make some commission. All right. This is the Pagani section behind me, guys. So we have a bunch of Paganis. Let's look at all of them. Oh, that's a lot. <laughs> Wyra, Wyra BC, another Wyra BC. Let's take a close look. It's all exposed carbon. Wow. Just the different color schemes is also really interesting on the Paganis. This one is, this one has this teal blue, I don't know if that's teal, baby blue <laughs> accents on it. Roadster. And then there's this white and like orangish wire as well. Through this crowd to look at the Devo. He's taking a picture, so after him. Alright. This is a one of 40 car guys. What do you guys think about these like baby blue accents? This is the side view. It has the flag right there. Let's take a look at the back. Wow. This is really interesting. It has a ton of carbon fiber. Of course, 1500 horsepower has a 1500 on the engine right there. Wow. This is the exhaust down here. But it's rad. Look at these lights. Oh my god. Do you guys see these lights? Whoa! Wow! Looks like a decoration. <laughs> That's crazy. 
Oh my god, even the exhaust. This is like art on a car. Wow. Let's make our way through the crowd. Take a look, guys. This is the front. It has that same Bugatti look to it, but also changed like these headlights, this blue lip down here. Check this out, guys. We have the 458 Speciale Aperta, and right next to it, there's an F50, a La Ferrari. It's the F50. There's a La Ferrari. Oh my god, there's people in every shot because there's so many people here. La Ferrari, another F50, and an F40. This is crazy. This lineup of Ferraris right here. No wonder we just saw this lineup of cars. This whole section is called the Great Ferrari. So that's why we just saw all of these cars. I can't right now, guys. This would be the fifth, and I'm just too full. So we had four lunches, but there's actually six lunch options here. I was so determined to try it, but I'm so full. Oh my god. What is this? Like, I'm sorry. It looks, the engine looks like a musical instrument going on here. This is pre-war sports and reading 1916 La Bestioni Beast. Wow. Oh my god. So it's in the section with all the classic cars. This isn't really classic, this is pre-war, so these are like really old cars. <laughs> really cool. Just got to the AMG section guys where they have the GT four-door coupe. I actually haven't seen this car, so. Let's take a look at the inside. Wow. This is really nice. They're letting people sit in the cars here. Ooh. This is one big screen. Wow. I like it. And normally I really don't like four doors, but this one I like. Because it has that like coupe look to it still. Wow. This is what the back looks like. It's a GT, oh, it's a GT C63S. And it's a sedan. This is interesting. What do you guys think? These are the back seats. Well, I will say, I like this a lot more than the C63S, the C63S sedan, for sure. We also have the new G-Wagon here. Tons of people crowded around it to see it. This is the trunk. I feel like we'll take a close look at it. Maybe later. Okay, yeah, it's way too crowded and competitive to take a look. Okay, I just saw something I've never seen before. Check this out, guys. PB18 e-tron by Audi. Do you guys know about this car? <laughs> There's red shocks right there. Wow. Okay. Oh, it looks like there's one seat in there. Look out here. We've got one. We've got two. Wow. It just looks super futuristic. Really, really cool. 
So this is Are you? Oh, we were actually following you when you were doing your you upside down Camaro. Guys at McLaren at the Quail, they have this exposed green carbon fiber Senna. It's really cool. It's actually my first time seeing a Senna in person. As you guys can see, the exhaust is up here, and the engine is sort of exposed in here. It was an accident. But yeah, all I really noticed, not all I noticed, but predominantly you just see this big wing. Conaseg part. They have these two Conasegs here. This one's actually glittery, which is really interesting. Look who it is, it's Christian von Conaseg himself with these two very, very special Conasegs. It's such a pleasure to meet you. Well, so nice meeting you too. My pleasure. So McLaren Conaseg, and here we have Rolls Royce with the Cullinan up there. So we'll get up there and take a closer look at that. It is. Trust me, it's not just me. It's like a big phantom. <laughs> oh, that's that. Yeah. I don't mind it. The one with the tent on the back. You know, it's like, I like that. You know, you know, it's the last thing you can take It has these classic Rolls Royce doors. It's supposed to be super luxurious, which it is. It's so soft. Oh my god. It's like sitting on a cloud. I think this is really where you're supposed to be in a colony. Oh, the back's the hardest. Oh, it's just so soft. Side profile with the doors closed. What do you guys think? The last two cars at the Quail I want to show you guys are my friend Dr. M3's Purple Monte and this beautiful red Ferrari Enzo. A ton of cool cars here guys and I hope you enjoyed seeing some of my favorites here. Um, I'm actually going to take you guys with me to the Lambo party after this but that is it for Quail. I think it's like 3 o'clock Quail ends at 4 o'clock so just a little while more here and then we're going to get going to the Lambo party. I've chosen like three pairs of potential heels for today, but I ended up wearing sneakers because my feet hurt so much from the heels I was wearing at the quail. So, sneakers to the Lambo party. Parking lot for the Lamborghini party we're going to, guys. That's Alex Choi. We're gonna we're gonna get it. We're gonna sneak him in, and that's Beep Suspects. He's trying to hide. What's up? I definitely feel better about my sneaker choice after Alex Choi showed up. So that's good. <laughs> we just got to the Lamborghini party. <laughs> Welcome. Hi, welcome. Welcome in. Thank you. We have the SVJ63 in that corner. So what makes this car really special is the entire top is carbon fiber. There's only 63 of these ever being made. Everybody's trying to take pictures. Oh, no, no, go ahead. All right, we're just going to do a quick walk around the car. You guys see all carbon fiber top. But otherwise, it's the same in the back as the SVJ we saw today at the Quail. Auto vlog. at the door, champagne at the door. Hi. Ooh. Would you like to try one? No, I'm okay, thank okay. you. <laughs> Very nice, guys. Check this out. There's a backside over there, which we'll look at as well. And an upstairs, too. Get to the back now. <laughs> thank you. You 
you guys might have seen this already on my Instagram. There's a little SVJ model in the water. How cute! What do you think? If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, guys. I'm so tired, so I'm going straight to bed. Bye, guys.